All right, guys. Um, decided to come out and hit a couple spots today, and um, I'm using the six-inch coil, as you can see here. And um, I'm in park one, and I'm hitting a spot that I've pounded pretty good, so I decided I'd come over it with the six-inch and see what I could find. And um, again, we've hammered this place, but um, just trying out some new settings. I got the recovery turned up to seven, uh, which is probably not a good thing for the six inch because usually that really cuts down on your depth. But this place is loaded with iron, so I said I would try and uh, just see what happens uh, with the recovery at seven. And lo and behold, uh, my first hole, which you see here, and then over here, out pops a beautiful but a nice shank on the back uh, early colonial button very heavy um, rang up about a 12 13 on the equinox 800 uh, but again a very nice button um, probably one of the nicest ones i found off of this site so uh, again um, Equinox is doing the work and we will keep after it and maybe something else is in here that it possibly I've missed and maybe I can sneak some things out with the little six inch coil. Okay, I will catch you guys on the next one. Okay guys, got a 15, 16 signal right here. Praying to God it's not a shotgun shell. I just dug a button right there near it and um, Hopefully this is something good. So let's check it out and see what we got. Oh, I can already tell you, it's a piece of iron. And I'm already crunching down on it. So, get it out of here. Ooh. Yeah, something like a, really don't know what it is, but it's a piece of, probably some farm equipment. Let's see if I see any, any markings on it. But no luck, just a nice piece of iron ringing up really good in the middle of all this iron. So uh, again, we'll keep after it. Hopefully something else will come along. All right, catch you guys soon. GoPro stop recording. All right guys, got a, got a 16 signal here. It's staying pretty steady. I'm hoping it's not iron. Uh, but it looks like it could be something good. So let's see what it is. Ah, I already see what it is. It's a pin. <laughs> Somebody dropped their pin out here. So uh, nothing good this time. Anyway, we'll keep after it. All right, catch you guys on the next one. GoPro stop recording. All right, looking down here on the ground, looks like we got a nice piece of old English brick so we know we're in the right spot look at those black specks in there so uh, we'll keep after it I just found a pin which is crazy um, out here in the middle of this uh, lot which is on an old rice plantation but um, anyway we know we're on the right area and we know we're in the right area so hopefully uh, some more stuff's gonna pop out okay talk with you guys soon okay a few feet away from that uh, pin and uh, the iron that I dug looks like I might have another another button down here let's um, I just already already popped the hole and there it is button number two it's a tomback it's the smaller variety uh, nothing on the front though unfortunately but we'll take it maybe something will come out with something on it still finding buttons off of this place even though we've hammered it but again I'm using a different technique today with the six six inch coil and um, I've got the recovery turned up to seven so we're going pretty quick through this iron and um, stuff's coming out of here so let's see if there's I was going to say there could be something on it, but I can't tell anything. I'll clean it up, and we'll look at it later. Okay, catch you guys on the next one. Okay, guys, I got a 14, 13, 15. It's a little bouncy signal. 
We're gonna see what it is. It's right here in the middle of all this iron. Well, it could be a piece of iron now. All right, it's showing up 12, 13, 14. Let's dig some more and see what we get. Well, it looks like we got a piece of wire. So that fooled us. Anyway, we'll keep after it. GoPro stop recording. Okay guys, I'm still out here at the rice plantation and I just popped a hole and I believe I've got a nice top to a pewter spoon. Still working with the six inch coil and the high recovery. It's doing really, really well in this iron this is a really heavy heavy loaded iron sight for sure so i'll take that spoon top of a spoon fork i don't know one of them but anyway i'll take it and we'll keep on all right okay guys got a 19 here let's hope it's not a shotgun shell let's dig it out and see what we got Got it out. Ah, and we got messed up with the old shotgun shell.